Hey guys, it's uh, Hobbs, and um, Hobbs Boys, I decided I'd give you a little uh, EDC video. Uh, I know a lot of you guys like these, and uh, yeah, so uh, let's get started. Um, we'll work away from the front to the back, and um, right off the bat here, we have um, my PSP, and uh, I really like it. I just got it not too long ago, as I said in my account update, my friend gave it to me, and uh, right here, I have a little lanyard hole. Um, and it just clips in there like this, you know, just clips uh, right in there. And so I've got a lanyard on it whenever I want to, but uh, when I don't, I just clip it out and throw that in my backpack. But um, it's nice to uh, have uh, a little backup for uh, media, you know, uh, in case my uh, iPod dies. But I really like it, I think, right now. I have, uh, yeah, I have Fight Night Round 3 in there. Uh, it's kind of, it's pretty cool. But, uh, yeah, so that's my uh, PSP. Uh, moving on, right here we have uh, my phone. Uh, this is the uh, Rant by Samsung. Um, great phone. Great phone. I love it. Uh, it's got a 2, point, uh, 2 megapixel camera on the back. Um, a slide out full QWERTY keyboard. Um, it's a uh, great. You see, I've got the weather on there, etc. There's my lighter. Um, a great phone. I should have a review out on this um, soon, and the also the rumor. Um, next, we have my iPod. Um, my iPod, love this thing. I don't know. I wouldn't go anywhere without it. Um, I use it all the time. Uh, on here, I've got a. Uh, a hard plastic case uh, made by Griffin and inside the case you may notice that I have a, a five gum wrapper and uh, you may be wondering well what has you got that in there but uh, the reason is is it distinguishes my iPod from everyone else's um, the school I go to I've had my iPod stolen before and because I had this uh, this in here it was easy for me to uh, distinguish it and get it back I mean there's really not anyone who has this in there so uh, that's the reason why I carry it in there also just uh, adds a little color to it um, but anyways I think the case was like 10 bucks at Walmart um, then we have uh, just a little big lighter I uh, took the casing off I don't really like those on there but uh, yeah so just a little big lighter um, I don't smoke but uh, it's always good to have a a flame source with you to start a fire. Um, then over here we have my wallet. Um, it's a trifold, basic trifold. Um, there's really nothing in it right now because uh, because I just got my wallet stolen actually, and um, so I haven't had time to replace all the stuff in there. But I got this for 12 bucks at Walmart. It's a leather one. It's actually pretty nice for for how cheap it was. But uh, anyways, then. Uh, to the left here we have a small Swiss Army knife. Um, it's just really compact, and um, you've got the nail trim, uh, nail care, uh, small knife, scissors, which I actually use the scissors more than anything else. Um, you've also got the little toothpick right there, and on the other side, uh, tweezers right there. But um, it's pretty cool. I always have this with me, no matter where I am, um, unless I'm in the pool. Um, but anyways, it's a great uh, thing to carry with you. Next, I have uh, my uh, flash drive. Um, this is a little cheap one. I think we got it free. Um, my dad uh, does lectures sometimes, and they give him free stuff. And so, Bausch and Lom, um gave him a bunch of these flash drives, and uh, he gave me one. Or, so... Uh, I carry that with me to carry my projects on it and whatnot. Then uh, over here, in this uh, cheap little uh, bag, I have my Maxim knife I showed in the video. Um, yeah, um, I've been switching back and forth between using this um, and my uh, uh, my Benchmade Striker. Um, I just get tired of using it sometimes, and uh, people are pretty actually are intimidated by the Benchmade since it's uh, got the black blade with the Tonto style. Um, so I carry that, and people don't really bother by this. And I uh, just bought this for like four bucks at a uh, gas station. So uh, 
I carry that every so often. It's already scratched up a lot, but it's just stainless steel, really cheap. But, you know. And um, I will say I am a high school student, so I generally do not have that with me. Um, because, you know, you're not supposed to bring weapons into school and whatnot. I don't want to get suspended. But I uh, do always have this with me. Um, I have it in the little coin pocket of my jeans. And um, it's so small. Uh, and really, I only use the scissors. So uh, people don't really care whether or not I have this because uh, of its small size. So that's generally what I carry. Then uh, over here, um, I have a small pin. Uh, this is a pin made by uh, Cross, I think. And uh, it comes with this little thing that pops on the cap here. And you can have it on your keychain. But uh, it just comes out like that. Um, it's got your pin. And what I really like about these is that uh, when you buy them, there's refills. that Because the pin cartridge is only this big. But uh, you can swap it out and have... Uh, like any color of ink that you of cartridge you want in there so I always carry with me uh, a red cartridge for when we grade papers at school and um, blue just to mix it up but right now there's a black one in there and uh, I think that costs like 20 bucks at uh, Office Depot it's a pretty nice pen um, then uh, you may be wondering why I have a coin up here but the reason I have a coin with me is uh, because I've been getting into magic and so uh, I uh, carry this coin with me to practice whenever I'm bored. Um, it's a Canadian $2 piece. Um, I found that it works the best because it's a little bit bigger than a quarter. And it's, uh, well here, I'll give you a little comparison. You see, here's a quarter. It's a little bit bigger. Not much, but just a little bit bigger. And it's, a, it's actually, I think it's lighter than a quarter. Um, so, I use that for my magic tricks. Uh, and then in the back here, we have my reading glasses. Um, these are my, they're made by Gucci, and I think these cost uh, 200, 250 I want to say. Um, they're really nice. Uh, I wear them whenever I read, like I said, um, study, and around the house. Generally where I'm, when I'm making videos, I wear them, but uh, obviously I can't wear them and show them to you. Um, and still be behind the camera. But uh, then, lastly, I have my um, Oakleys. These are the canteens. Um, love these glasses. They're great. Uh, they have my prescription lenses in them, so um, that's awesome. Don't have to wear contacts with them. And I think these cost like 230 or more. But yeah, my dad is a uh, optometrist, so we get uh, all Oakleys, half price, and all glasses. So. Uh, that's how I got those. I've also got like an Oakley backpack and whatnot. And also, I uh, always carry with me the camera that I'm actually filming this with. And it goes in this little case um, by Samsonite. And inside, I uh, always keep a, a spare battery. See Canon. Um, this, what I use to make my videos is just a Canon PowerShot ST1000. Um, I found it gives actually a pretty clear picture, you see, um, and I like it a lot, so, yeah. Uh, this is just a bare minimum of what I carry. I usually have some uh, tape and some uh, little first aid kit with me, but uh, this is really just the interesting stuff in my opinion. So uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video, uh, thanks for watching.